Hi guys. Um, so I wanted to give you a little bit of information about how to uh, do your Anansi Tale project, right? So you're creating a new Anansi story. So Anansi has to be your main character and he has to trick somebody. And it can either end with Anansi like winning or with the person that he tricked, tricking him back instead. Um, so you'll need at least two characters, right? One will be Anansi and then one will be another character that he's in conflict with that he's trying to trick. Uh, it can be somebody you make up. It can be another character from mythology. It can be from a different mythology. It doesn't really matter. Um, but you've got some kind of choices there. So I'm going to show you real quickly how to use slides, uh, just in case you're not sure how to use it. So um, you'll go to your drive. Okay, so you have drive open. You'll hit new and then Google Slides. All right, so then you'll have this um, presentation. Okay, um, we don't want to use a blank presentation because those are boring. Um, and, you know, this is a project, so we need to kind of some work here. So I would use, you can use one of these themes along the side. Right, or if you want to, you can um, put in like a new background. So let's say, you know, I want mine to take place in the jungle. So I'm gonna delete this. I'm gonna hit background uh, and I'm gonna say image. And there's a couple ways that you can find stuff. Um, one easy way is Google image search. So uh, you can search jungle, right? And these are some of the things that come up. So let's see, I want this one. And then you hit insert. And then there, so you can have it, um, you can add it to the theme. So that means that every uh, every slide that you use will have this on there, um, or you can change the background on each one. It doesn't really much matter. Like I said, you can use one of these right here. Um, so the way that you can add text is you click on this text box right here, click and drag, right? And then you can type right over it, hello. Uh, and you just want to make sure that it's nice and easy for me to read. So probably white will be a little bit better here. We'll make it bold. Um, and if it's still kind of hard to read, what you can do is um, the highlight color, which is right here, you can make that black and then it's nice and easy to read. Okay. Um, so that's a, a kind of way that you can write on those backgrounds. Um, the other thing you can do is you can actually make the text box uh, under format options, there's a way to make the text box darker. Here it is. Um, so here you want solid, right? Um, and I'm going to make a solid black, right? Uh, and then you can type in white over top of it with no problem. Um, or you can make the background anything that you kind of want it to be for your text box. And that'll make, your, make it a little easier. Uh, you can insert pictures by going to insert image. Um, and you can search the web again, like we said. Um, so I need a spider. Um, so like this is going to be my Anansi. Okay. Uh, and then you can click and drag, make it bigger or smaller. You can move it around. If you grab this little circle here at the top, you can rotate it. See, it's upside down. Um, but if these pictures aren't doing it for you, you want something a little bit more specific. All you have to do is um, open up Google and search like Anansi Spider. And then go to your images. Okay, so, you know, I wanna use this one. I like the way that this one looks. So uh, right click on it and hit open image in new tab. Okay, so now I've got a URL. So I'm gonna copy and paste. I'm gonna go back to my presentation. I'm gonna go to insert. Uh, image, and I'm going to do by URL. So I'm going to copy and paste, and then insert. And so now I've got this one. Um, the only thing you need to make sure that you do is that you cite these pictures. So that same URL, what I would do is I would make a blank slide, right? And you do that by saying Control um, M will give you a blank slide, right? And I would just go ahead and copy and paste all of your um, change the background on this one. Um, uh, so you, I just copy and paste all the pictures, basically all the URLs and the pictures that you have, um, so that you and you'll just title this works again. Okay. Uh, and then when it's done, you'll just share it like you normally do. So I'll name it. Save. Um, and you'll get your link, 
Okay, can view, that's fine. Copy, and then you'll upload it to Canvas like you normally do with all of your assignments, okay? Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, I look forward to reading your stories. Bye, everybody.